Hello. I wanted to hop on this morning to share something really exciting. This morning I was just listening to uh, something on YouTube and it went over into Greg Braden, uh, who I love. I love what he shares and everything that he's about. And it was a simple practice on how to relieve daily stress. And I was like, oh, yes, please. Right? When we're sensitive, when we're highly sensitive, most of the people I work with are highly sensitive and empaths, we feel things on a much deeper level. And so stress that might be on a level five for an, uh, the average person, for us it could be a 10 out of 10. So finding simple practices to help bring our nervous system back to calm are key. Again, to keep the stress, the anxiety, the overwhelm uh, in, out of our space or in control. So this was, I, I, did, I did this morning, it was just wonderful. So it's three basic steps. And it starts with going from your outer world into your inner world. And that we focus on our heart. So you can put your hand on your heart if you want and just feel your heart, close your eyes if you want and just feel your heart. So that's the first step. The second step is to slow our breath. And I found this fascinating because when we slow our breath, it tells, especially on the exhale, making the exhale longer than the uh, inhale, it tells our parasympathetic nervous system and our vagus nerve that we're safe. And of course, when we're stressed, we're like in fight or flight. Uh, and so, so he suggests breathing in for five and breathing out for eight. So just give that a try. And again, you can count. And what I did with this, I just added a little something was I, because he talked about the resonance with Mother Earth as well, is I breathed, I breathe in and I feel the, the gold light going up to my head. And then as I breathe out, I see that gold light going down through my heart and then connecting to the heart of Mother Earth. And this is part of what he talks about is we are connecting, we are creating resonance between the head and the heart, but also it's the same resonance that Mother Earth uh, emanates. And so we are part of Mother Earth. And so it just, it was like the missing piece for me because I've known about the head and the heart resonance, but connecting into Mother Earth and as HSPs, as empaths, we generally have a very strong connection with nature. And so for me, it was, it really was a light bulb. So I'm fascinated to hear from you all if you feel a connection, a different, a different sensation, because I know for me, head, heart, and then connecting into Mother Earth. And I was like, oh, my whole body was just like, yes. And then I see a golden light coming back up with my breath, up to my brain, back through my heart, down into the heart of Mother Earth. So just, just feel that and again, exhaling slower. That tells the whole body shh, we're safe. And then the last piece, the third step is to feel a very high vibe emotion. For example, love, gratitude, joy, freedom, excitement, whatever, whatever you want to tap into. For this little exercise, we could just tap into gratitude. That's a, that's an easy one. Gratitude for a beautiful day. Gratitude for yourself. Gratitude for the food in your fridge. Gratitude that you have eyes and ears to listen to this video. It could be anything. Just feel the gratitude and then that helps that resonance build between the heart and the head and then it lines up with the resonance with Mother Earth. And it's 0.1 hertz. Again, I'm not scientific, but, but Greg shares all this and it's just, it's beautiful just to feel that. And the recommendation is to do it for three minutes. I did it for 15 minutes again. And you can do it at any, as many times as you want throughout the day. It's so simple. Uh, so give it a try and see if that helps bring your stress levels down. And, and again, if you want more detail, go check out Greg's video on YouTube. Um, I put the title in the, in the little blurb below. And... Uh, Enjoy, enjoy feeling calmer, no more overwhelm, no more stress, anxiety. Give it a shot.